Hey everyone, Jared VK3 Bravo Lima here, and um, I'm lucky enough to have my production manager back in the shack. I'll just turn that down a bit actually. Um, so, you get to see my ugly face and very long beard again, which uh, some people have commented on, and uh, that's got quite a few laughs. Anyway, um, thanks for all your support. Just want to say that, putting it out there, really appreciate it. This video is going to be about using PSK, the built-in PSK31 um, decoder in the IC7610. And it's going to cover how to set it up um, and how to get going. So hopefully some people find that useful. I know some people have asked for um, RIDI and PSK videos. Here it is. Let's have a play. So the first thing you do is um, go and change your mode um, to PSK, of course. Now then, nothing immediately is different. If you key the radio, you won't get any output. Um, doesn't do anything like that. You're thinking, what have I just done? That's okay. The key is menu, decoder. Now, you've got your decoder there, and um, you can see there's some stuff from the previous QSO. I'll turn the volume back up, just so we can uh, hear the PSK signal. And I've pre-arranged uh, to have a QSO with someone so that everyone can um, see what it's like. It's actually quite hard to find a, a PSK QSO these days. Um, the person I'll be talking to actually had to post a wanted ad for a PSK QSO. That's how popular the new digital modes are. But nonetheless, I really like the mode and I'm glad it's built into the radio. Let's get started. Um, Mr. Production Manager, can you please zoom in to this area? We've got the IC7300 here. It um, doesn't have an antenna connected, but it'll, it'll, um, you'll be able to hear my transmitted signal on it. We're running about, a, about 100 watts, which is just shy of our limit of 120 in VK for uh, continuous modes, and we'll get started. I've got a little keyboard here, and I've set the radio up to use the function buttons so that I don't have to go into the TX menu um, option to, you know, to uh, transmit one of my pre-programmed menus. I'll show you what that's like, um, just for explanation purposes. So if we hit text menu, this one here, um, my call calling CQ and my call calling CQ with three times my call, they're all mapped. All of these options, one to eight, are mapped to the function keys, one to eight. So let's start with um, push to talk to. There we go, we're transmitting away. Hopefully that noise isn't too annoying and hopefully my friend is still on frequency. Now we're standing by, we've got a little, oh, there we go. And it's, we've got D, V, K, E, 1, Charlie, Tango, K. And I'll say, uh, dear Chris, we're recording now. Thanks for the sked. I really appreciate it. Would you like to tell our listeners about your working conditions. And then I'll go and hit F1 to send that. Um, I've found the best way to send is to use a macro, uh, which is you know one of the F1 to F8 uh, function keys. And I just send the one that says DE VK3BL VK3BL um, K. That's a good way of ending. PSK guys will know that. Anyway, it's really cool that I can type um, a custom message in and then send it in advance. It's quite quick, it, it, it works quite nicely, and um, you know, a cheap little keyboard like this is just perfect. So we've sent that message now, and we'll stand by for um, Chris's response. It might take a while, Chris is using a different setup. We've got, hello Jared. I am using FT817 with a Samsung Galaxy. So he's actually using it with, uh, with a, a mobile phone, so that's pretty cool. Um, for a portable setup as well, uh, I imagine he'll have quite uh, good fun with that. Uh, what else is he saying? So he's using a digital interface. I didn't quite copy um, which digital interface it is. It's the word ends in link, something link 
I'm, I'm going to go with Signal Link probably. And he's using Droid PSK um, on his uh, Android phone. So he's only using low power, and I'm copying him beautifully. The decoder in this radio is really nice. So I'm going to reply. Thanks for letting us know that, Chris. Great copy about 85% um, all perfect. Um, that sounds like a fan, uh, fantastic portable setup and I'll have to talk to you more about it. Now we'll send that back to him, F1. So that's one thing I really like, um, is that you sort of type the message in advance and then send it. You can, um, you can type while, while, you're, while, they're, while they're coming back to you, uh, if you want to. That, that makes the QSOs a, a bit snappier. Um, but I just like the fact that it sends it all at once rather than sending a, a, an unmodulated carrier and um, sort of just coming across slowly and that sort of thing. So I, I really like the way this works. Um, I prefer it even to using um, FL Digi, which is what I used to use on my computer. Um, and I'm quite happy about it. I'm happy people asked me to make this video because I'll be honest I wouldn't have tried this feature um, for some time So Chris is coming back to us now He said thanks Jared So Chris is taking a little longer to reply because he's actually um, he's actually modulating the PSK or, or entering the characters on the fly, just like uh, the old uh, teleprinters. Um, so, what have I got? Thanks, Jared. Yes, should. Uh, can use. And. Android, I think that was. And. Uh, can use an Android device. Um, I'm out of luck because I'm an iPhone guy and a, and a Mac guy. But um, it does sound like a lot of fun for those uh, who, who can do it. Um, so I'm going to, I'll say 73 for now and wind this particular video up. And uh, we'll, we'll do a follow-up one to, uh, to show you what the decode screen looks like um, with in greater resolution. Okay, so dear Chris, thank you for the QSO. I'll say 73 for the moment as we we have to move the camera closer in to see the decoded screen. Please stand by for another CQ. Thank you again. Okay, so another CQ, yes, well, another CQ and, uh, and QSO. Uh, my manager pointed out that uh, um, both would be appropriate. So he actually just said he's just running a few watts and uh, we're getting great copies, so let's send that off. And that pretty much completes this video. Um, we've demonstrated using the um, PSK decoder and uh, the PSK, well, I guess encoder um, that uses your, uh, just uses a keyboard and can have some macros. So I'll, uh, I'll wind it up. I'll say 73 and thanks for watching.